So the quick cooker did indicate um, seven minutes ago that it was done. So my corn is ready. Um, usually I don't leave it in that long, but uh, I'm sure it's fine. So at least the pressure's already gone down. Pop the lid off. Oh, it smells so good. And let's take a look. Nice cobs of corn there. I'm just gonna grab a plate. And my tongs. And the small chef tongs, or I could grab you know, what I can do. Because I've got the they are not hot. So the corn holders are not hot. You can actually take them right out. And sit down for a second. There we go. Look at those corn holders. All right, so just let me show you how we use the, I'm going to go over here to my other cupboard though. I don't, I don't roll it onto the floor first. I like working over here. Turn it around. There we go. All right. <laughs> Get organized. So the kernel cutter. Watch how easy this is. Actually, I'm going to take one of these out. Hot. but handy this way too as simple as so anyone that has braces dentures and has to cut their corn take a look just like that now I'm doing it a little sloppy of course you probably be a little neater and you can get cream corn by getting right down into so making cream corn you get right in there There we go. And as easy as that, we have our corn. And then the corn butterer. I can actually show you how that works still. Move this over a bit. Pop the lid off. And give it a little push. And I can just turn. And the holder works great for that too. Turn and butter my corn. Just like that. Slather it in butter. Mmm. Yeah, it does look really good, actually. Just gonna... Oh, perfectly cooked, too. Okay, that is it.